Susan Lemon, your host with White Labs, an e-commerce marketing agency. Today's guest is Neha. Neha, feel free to introduce yourself and let our viewers know about your background. This is Neha Sikter. I'm a 17-year-old in high school, and about two years ago, I founded a uh, I, I founded Disorder, a zero waste fashion brand free from gender conventions. Um, yeah, that's been my experience, just kind of as a high schooler navigating through, you know, my entrepreneurial journey and also kind of balancing high school and, you know, my ambitions for the future. Awesome. What in, what inspired you to create the brand? So I was actually listening to a podcast and I heard the term like genderless fashion and yeah, I never really heard about it. It was about in 2021, 2020 maybe. And I just kind of like did some research research on it and I realized it was this whole world of, you know, beautiful garments and it was a beautiful concept and I realized that it was, it was completely kind of milked of what it was, you know, the, the, um, what was constantly promoted was kind of the masculine ideals of gender evolution. and it brought into question, you know, where's the femininity, where, where can we embrace um, feminine gender roles, or femininity for both men and women. And so that was kind of what inspired it. Awesome. Who's your, uh, who is your target audience? So we wanted to kind of redirect the, from the uh, conventional um, audience in fashion. So it, typically, you know, when you think of, uh, genderless fashion, we think people part of the LGBTQ community. And I kind of wanted to point out that there's this huge sector um, of people who are actually interested in these garments who aren't necessarily part of that community. Um, kind of mainstream people for, I guess, uh, 18, 30 years old in the United States predominantly. Awesome. What makes you uh, different or, uh, or as I say, better than your competitors? Well, I mean, I tried not to make this the biggest, the selling point, because I don't think it is, but I think uh, my, uh, image as the founder, like a 17 year old, I think that's one thing that kind of helps me stand out, but also, uh, we focus a lot on community building and, 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 and leveraging the stories of people who kind of, um, are on the same path of degendering fashion and, and promoting, you know, feminine ideals in society and industry that only pr pr promotes masculine roles. Uh, so my, well, most of our. Listeners and audience are entrepreneurs that have e-commerce brands. What, what are some challenges that you face and how have you overcome them? A lot. You know, you face challenges every day. Um, biggest thing has been trying to find ways to stand out, especially in fashion. You know, it's a completely saturated industry. Um, what you kind of have to navigate is how can I leverage my idea, my mission in way to appeal to my, to my audience? And how can you use your image and individuality to kind of bridge that connection between your, your brand and your customers? So definitely one thing, um, I think face challenges every day. So it's hard to, to, you know, just select a few, but yeah, I would say in general, it's just tr trying to find ways to st stand out in such a, a saturated industry. Great. What are your uh, what are your best selling products? We actually just have one product, but there's about two or three more uh, coming soon. So that product we have is selling pretty well right now. And uh, what, sorry, is the, what, what is Yeah, the, sorry, I didn't, I didn't answer your question. Okay. Yeah, uh -huh. uh, it's called the cropped one. So it's basically a uh, cropped one uh, one sleeved V neck. It's in black. It's made from tensile modal, which is made from uh, biodegradable wood. So it's just simply an ethically made. Great. And where can we buy your pants? Okay. Where, where can we buy? We can, where can we buy the pants? Yeah, if you, you know can buy. Sure. Uh, it's at our website, um, www.desoire.com. That's our website. And you can also use our Instagram page at Desoire Official, D E S O I R E Official, um, Instagram shop on there. Awesome. What is your future plan for yourself and the brand? At 17 years old and already having a brand, it's awesome. What, what, what's your future plan? See how how big this can get. And on, uh, well, I guess for me, there's no limit, and I just want to see, you know, how much I can scale this. And you know, I guess my biggest ambition is that I can actually, uh, or as a community, can achieve the goal of degendering fashion. And um, yeah, it's just a journey from here out. Awesome. What are some uh, successful things you've done to promote the brand marketing wise anything and a lot of uh paid ads so that's definitely been one driving factor in our marketing um thing i think has been getting featured in magazines and blog posts 
So sending ton, like hundreds of, of pitches and emails to people that have the same kind of mindset on fashion um, as our brand uh, and who are like fashion editors, lifestyle editors um, with them and being featured on their editorials have been a huge help. That's, that's amazing. Any advice you can give to uh, very young entrepreneurs like yourself? You know, I think the biggest thing is that I feel like we kind of take advantage of the fact that we have all of the resources at our fingertips to make things happen. Um, a society where technology has give, gives us pretty much every step on how to launch a business, you know, it's your resources and, and realize that like the only limiting factor we have is ourselves and the sky's the limit. So just, just keep dreaming and never, never stop. Awesome. Is there, is there anything that I haven't asked you that you want our listeners to know about yourself? the brand that, that I haven't lost you, that you, anything out there that's burning? I think you hit all the questions, I think. Awesome. Well, I, I appreciate you coming on the white pod. I appreciate your time and I listened to about yourself and your amazing journey and uh, you have a great day. It was nice talking to you. Thank you. Definitely.